Germany is renowned for its engineering prowess, and it has indeed showcased its capabilities through a series of impressive mega projects. From the world's longest underwater road and rail tunnel to a substantial $33 billion investment in a new factory, Germany has left its mark on the mega project landscape. The nation's ambitious endeavors also include a massive power plant facing an uncertain future and a remarkable train station that underwent a 90-degree rotation. That being said, here are the top 10 most expensive mega projects in Germany. Costing over $900 million, the Elbville Harmony in Hamburg swiftly became the city's iconic landmark upon completion. This concert hall boasts a truly unique design, with its base housed in a former warehouse featuring an unchanged old brick design that seamlessly integrates with the surrounding buildings. In contrast, the upper half of the structure adopts a modern aesthetic, characterized by a glass exterior and a distinctive wave-shaped roof. Upon its public debut, the project garnered a significant international response from major press outlets. While most feedback was positive, there were criticisms regarding the acoustics of the concert hall. Nonetheless, with over 2.6 million visitors, the Elbe Philharmony has solidified its place as one of the most intriguing attractions in Hamburg. Costing $1.6 billion, the Datton 4 coal-based power plant has a complex history that dubbed it the largest illegal construction site in Germany. Its origins trace back to the 1960s, when the original Datsun power plant fueled 20% of German railways and provided heating for 45% of households in Datteln. All three blocks of the plant, however, had operational licenses valid only until 2012. With the impending expiration of these licenses, the proposal to construct a new block, Datsun 4, was put forth. Intended to surpass the electrical output of the existing three blocks combined, Datton 4 aimed to become one of the most efficient coal power plants globally in relation to its size. Despite the legal hurdles, the plant eventually opened in 2020 and is presently operational. Even though the legal situation surrounding it remains unresolved, the future of Germany's last modern coal plant is uncertain, and only time will reveal whether it will continue to play a role in the country's energy landscape. Costing $2.1 billion, Frankfurt, Germany's financial hub renowned for its striking skyline, is currently in the midst of a transformative project set to redefine its cityscape. This ambitious venture, named 4, is poised to become one of the city's most prestigious constructions, introducing an entirely new corridor comprising offices, apartments, hotels, and shops. The project features four interconnected skyscrapers linked at a single base, showcasing a clever architectural design. The deliberate spacing between these towers and their facade creates a distinctive 360-degree panorama of the entire complex. Moreover, the orientation of the skyscrapers, combined with their vertical folds, is designed to maximize sunlight even at the base of the buildings. Costing $2.4 billion, Germany's commitment to phasing out fossil fuel energy and transitioning to clean energy is materializing through projects like Hohe See and Albatross, these separate wind parks located in the North Sea near the German-Dutch border have been combined into a single project. Notably, renewable energy already constitutes 44% of Germany's overall energy production. Situated in the open sea, the wind parks capitalize on strong sea winds while avoiding noise pollution. The wind park currently boasts an impressive electrical output of 640 megawatts, sufficient to power over 700,000 households. Costing $4.3 billion, Frankfurt Airport, the busiest airport in Germany, is undergoing significant expansion with the construction of a new terminal. In response to the high volume of passengers, which peaked at 70 million in 2019, and to enhance its competitiveness among European airports, Frankfurt Airport is developing Terminal 3. The new terminal is designed to feature three piers, namely G, H, and J collectively increasing the airport's capacity by 19 million passengers annually. Additionally, a fourth pier, K, is included in the plans as a potential future expansion, contingent on future passenger demands. Currently, two piers are still under construction, while Pier G has already been completed.
As Tesla expanded its market reach to encompass all of Europe, the company faced the challenge of meeting the region's demands by importing products from other continents. To address this, Tesla made a strategic decision to establish a gigafactory in Europe, focusing on the production of batteries, powertrains, and the Tesla Model Y. Currently, the facility which costs $5.5 billion to build is providing employment for more than 10,000 people and is gradually increasing its production capacity. As the sole Tesla facility of this magnitude on the entire continent, the Gigafactory has ambitious plans to achieve an annual production output of 750,000 automobiles in the future. Costing $7.5 billion, Berlin Brandenburg Airport currently serves as the primary commercial airport for Berlin and the surrounding Brandenburg area. Despite being open for only three years, the project has a protracted history. Following the fall of the Berlin Wall in the last century, Berlin and its environs were served by three separate airports, all experiencing increasing congestion. To address this, the concept of constructing a single mega airport to replace them was conceived. However, due to legal complications, it took over 15 years for this idea to be implemented. Nevertheless, Berlin Brandenburg Airport finally commenced operations under normal conditions in 2022, serving around 20 million passengers. The expectation is that this number will continue to rise in the future, solidifying the airport's role as a vital transportation hub for the region. Costing $7.8 billion, the Femarn Belt project aims to connect Germany and Denmark through Femarn Islands in the Baltic Sea, creating a more efficient route from Hamburg to Copenhagen. Currently, this route requires a ferry crossing, creating a bottleneck in transportation. The project involves the construction of two tunnels. The first tunnel will link Germany to Femarn, and the second tunnel will connect Femarn to Lolland. This tunnel will be an impressive 18 kilometers long, making it the world's longest combined road and rail tunnel. Additionally, the project will introduce a new railway route, enhancing the overall railway infrastructure in the region and facilitating a more direct connection between Germany and Denmark. Due to the project's magnitude, it is scheduled for completion in 2029. Costing $10.4 billion, the Stuttgart 21 Mega Project has been a highly controversial endeavor, marked even by incidents of violence. Stuttgart has long served as a crucial transportation hub in Germany, intersecting various railway lines. However, the existing infrastructure in the Stuttgart area was outdated and inefficient, prompting the proposal of the Stuttgart 21 project to address these issues. The project involves moving the train station underground and rotating it 90 degrees, transforming it from a terminal station to a through station. This redesign enhances connectivity with other cities. The project's distinctive feature is its roof, featuring shell-like pillars and a unique design that allows for glass domes to provide daylight to the station. The construction involved challenging and costly approaches, such as putting the building on stilts due to its listed status and digging almost 60 kilometers of new tunnels. The completion of Stuttgart 21 is anticipated in 2025. Costing over three times the budget of Stuttgart 21, the Intel Semiconductor Gigafactory slated for construction in Magdeburg emerges as the most costly mega project in Germany, with an estimated price tag of $33 billion. This ambitious venture is part of Intel's strategic initiative, IDM 2.0, aimed at competing with industry giants like Samsung and Nvidia. Originally projected to commence construction in early 2023 and complete within four years, the plan has encountered setbacks due to emerging financial challenges stemming from escalating energy and material costs. Which of these mega projects stands out as the most impressive? Feel free to share your thoughts in the comments below and subscribing to the channel. Thank you for watching and we'll catch you in the next one.